I got plum fancy. Right, I'm going to show you mine. I mean mine ultimate. Right, it's see you in a bit. Right guys, as I said in the, at the beginning, this is my ultimate fire kit, this is what I class as mine, I'm not saying it is the ultimate fire kit, it's just what I class as my ultimate fire kit, because I've been working on this, or not working on it, I finished it off yesterday, but I've been thinking about it for a long time, what to add to this and what not to add to it, and what makes it better, what makes it, what I can lose. So that's the reason why I call it my ultimate fire kit because it is just for me. Right, if I go into this one, this one, it's my Hudson Bay Plymouth Steel Kit. I do have more char cloth in my workshop. I don't keep char, I keep just a little bit in here. But as you can see, it is just. <sighs> Sorry guys, my hand's not playing up today. Up, my hands playing up. As you can see, it's just my flint and steel kit. What Mad Dog gave me. So, yeah. So that's that one. That lives in that old egg bag. Right. This one here is my class as my ultimate fire kit. And I'm saying mine. I mean mine. You can have your fire kit. What's your ultimate fire kit? So. That's the way I see it. It is in a Max Redition fatty. Right in the front there, as you can see, I'm not going to take it out. It's a Fanzo lens. Yeah, so I'm going to open it up, show you what I've got, and I'll go through it. There you go. That's it. Opened up. That's, you can see most of it, not all of it, because some of it actually is put away um, in different places. So I'll do it this way quickly. There is my. No, you can't see it properly because it's black. <laughs> that there is my Echo Tac light sleeve thick lighter right next door to it. Right there is my pocket bellows. That's my fair rod. I'll show you more on that one in a minute. There's my life wire. I have a more Eldress in here. I have some Stormproof UCO Stormproof matches. I have some Protec. Fire plugs, and behind that, I have some strike anywhere matches. Right. As I said, I'll show more about this fair ward. This fair ward I bought off my dog, and I asked him to basically um, personalize it, so he did. He put PF. On it, I know you're not going to see this, so I know it's going to come back to front with you guys, but that's what it does. It's PF, and um, I really do appreciate that. So, yeah, right, let's put that one back in the back of this pocket. All I keep back here is my um, microphone glass. Yes, I do have a pencil lens in the beginning at the front, but I like to have a magnifying glass as well in this clip. So, why do I carry another more Eldress in this kit? Basically, the one on my belt stays on my belt. This one here stays in my fire kit. I don't like carrying more loads of knives, but this one, yeah, is. Fantastically good as a striker, fantastically good processing tinder down. So that's the reason why, and it fits nicely in this kit. That's the reason why I have had it for this kit. Oh, so yeah, right back here. This is it. I don't know if you can see that. If I undo it, I know a lot of people are going to say this is a lot of um, five stars, but truth is, to me personally, as a long wolf. I need to make sure I can do things 
I do have natural materials in my rucksack as well as um, like all over my rucksack. So yeah. Right, the first one, this one here, is the Ultimate Fire Tinder from Poltec. Full Poltec Camp Company. So that's the Ultimate Fire starter. Again, I love my dog stuff. I'm going to carry my dog stuff. I've used so many things of my dog stuff and I love them. So I'm going to carry them because they're not really mass produced. Not like this and those fire plugs. He's a handmade by Mad Dog. So I've got some of his um, Mad Dog jewels. As well as some Mad Dog wicks. That's all I have in this way. In my class, what I class as my Ultimate Fire Kit. So yeah, this here can do so much more for me. And I can do so much with it. I can add, I can take away. Like that. Oh yeah, and as well, these are in the um, box out, so they can stay home dry. So, I'm leaving it here guys because it's coming over 6 minutes. Thank you very much for watching. If you like this video, please put the thumbs up and subscribe. Join us here at Bloom Friends. Please share the video. If you didn't like the video, please put the thumbs down, but please tell me why. And we will catch you in the next one. Thank you very much. Bye bye.